Hi, everyone, and welcome to Fearless Fridays. My name is Dr. Benjamin Ritter, Leadership and Empowerment Coach at LFY Consulting. And today I want to talk about deepening and connecting with your relationships. You know, in today's environment, we're, we're all told to stay at home, and can't go into work. We don't have the benefit of being in front of other people. And so we're missing a lot that usually helps deepen and connect with our relationships. But we do have the ability to go a step further than we normally have in the past. And sometimes just something a little bit more unique, something a little different, and that little extra effort towards a relationship can put you miles in front of everybody else. And so, you know, I'm thinking about what about sending someone, you know, a virtual e-card or a quarantine package? I don't care if I, even if it, if this isn't quarantine, if you're watching this in the future, some sort of care pack, package. I mean, we have Amazon. You can literally order anything to anyone at any time at the moment um, and a variety of other delivery services. Um, usually have happy hour with friends, send them a bottle of wine or do it yourself cocktail mix or a cocktail glass with their name on it for 15 bucks that you can get online. So there, there are little things that you can do that are inexpensive that will set you apart from everyone else. And so think about it. How can you deepen and connect further with your relationships and not just your good friends, not just your close relationships, but people that used to just maybe be office friends or someone that was responsible for managing a large contract for you at one of your clients. How can you take things just a step further that will make miles and miles of difference? So guys, if you've liked what you see, if you took one thing away from what you just listened to, leave your thoughts in the comments and share this with a friend. It truly helps spread the good word. And most importantly, everyone, keep on living for yourself.